Hey, it's good to see you. Today we are in Walmart and I came here to do nail polish, but they still have not put labels on the, they, they took all the labels and names off the uh, displays. So I can't do nail polish, but look, beautiful ornaments and stuff. Christmas has just blown up in here. So I thought we'd take a look at ornaments. <laughs> We have, okay, it's kind of organized by style. Oh, these are cute. I'm seeing ice skates everywhere this year. That must be like one of the predominant themes. And of course you have the truck tree. That's, an, that's a perennial favorite. Look at the little gingerbread person. <laughs> gingerbread lady. Little, so, oh, look at the Santa. He's so sparkly. Looks like he's gonna stab you with a tree. <laughs> I think it's bent. Hold on. <laughs> Let's fix his tree. Get back. <laughs> Does that look better? I think that's how it's supposed to be. See, these all have their trees standing erect. They're really excited for Christmas. I'm sorry. Oh God, okay. I got glitter on me. Here's a, oh, look at the little reindeer. I don't know where this goes. He was planted face down in the sparklies, but I don't think he goes there. Yeah, um, oh, that's a cute little pick. Look at that. See, it's got its little marijuana clip on it. Look at all that jolly. Holly jolly, oh my stars. We have these clip-on poinsettias. See, and they have little roach clips on them too. You can get these in all sorts of different colors. Over here we have these pretty red ones and burgundy. Everything's messed up. Ooh, isn't that a pretty red? Look at that. These are 98 cents each. For one of my Christmas trees, I'm doing red and gold. And I have a lot of, of these for my red and gold tree. Now, this section over here is more like, I don't know, what would you call that? Kind of a rustic Christmas look. Pretty though. Yeah, I'm. I'm thinking this looks like it. It belongs. It belongs right there. So these, most of these ornaments are less sparkly. Oh look, it's a skiing gnome. These are cute. Now most of these are a dollar ninety-eight each. That's pretty. With the skis on it. Little Christmas tree farms. Here we have antler. Oh, antlers and jingle bells. Oh, look at the little boots. Oh, you can get a little pair of these little plaid boots. These are adorable. Those are cute. Little sled, sleds. Now with a lot of these, it's good to get here when they first put them out um, because they don't a lot of these they don't have a ton of them so if there's a particular type that you like um, it might be good to go ahead and grab them when they first put them out we could come over here and organize ornaments they're oh well i think these actually fell off they're kind of heavy oh look at the little barn that's neat here we have a, a cowbell a, a cowbell that's decorated like I think it's supposed to be a snowman or something. I'm not really sure where that's supposed to go. I don't know. Put it right there. Oh, look at the owl. Isn't it cute? A little owl. It's so nice. Other people are on the owl looking at ornaments too. There is the gnome. I don't know. I don't think he goes there. Maybe, maybe he does. He does now. Oh, look, you could get little elf feet. <laughs> That's cute. Here's another one of these. Yes, they're so pretty. These, these are kind of burgundy and red. They have plaid ones. Pretty pine cones. Oh, and see down below here we have Oh, these are glass ornaments. Some of them are glass, some of them are not. There's some more ice skates. These are these are big, like a big version. You could even get little antlers like this, sparkly antlers. 
Look at some little Santa. Look at this clip, it looks frosty. Nice. Let's see, oh, here we have some in, in white and they have kind of a satiny finish to them too. It's pretty. I gotta go around, let's see. But then you get down to this part of the aisle and you, you start getting into the more sparkly. This is really more my kind of style right here, these more sparkly ornaments. Now there is a fan up there, it's very loud. There's hair color over here, I don't know why. Oh, look at these. These are glass, aren't they pretty? Oh wow. Ooh, look at the colors in this, in this set. That's beautiful. It doesn't go there. I actually bought a set of these already from a peacock tree. There's a Dr. Pepper. Zero sugar. <laughs> Here's it. There are three boxes of hair dye over here. How do you get over here and decide that you don't need your hair dye anymore? I'm gonna at least put them together. Oh, look at the little cactus. That's a dollar ninety-eight. Isn't he cute? <laughs> He's got on a cowboy hat. And we have. I like the pretty rainbow. Look at that. That is something that goes over here, but I don't, I don't know where. See, a lot of these they've already sold out. Look at the little dog. Oh, he's cute. <laughs> oh, ooh, this Santa's cool too. Nice. Oh, the little tree. That's heavy. Look at the little penguin. I guess that's a penguin. He's really cute, too. You can get ballerinas. Look, aren't they pretty? You can get a pink pig in a, in a ballerina costume. Pink Santas, that's pretty. And then look at all this sparkly stuff. You can get gold and silver sparkles. These are $1.48. Look at this little ornament. Yeah, I'm, I'm more drawn to the more sparkly stuff because I think I was a largemouth bass in my former life. Oh, this is cute. Look at this. A sparkly carriage. It's only $1.98. And it has a hanging doodah in there, a little bauble that hangs in the middle. It's like a chandelier. <laughs> Look at this dog. Oh, isn't he spiffy? I'm right by the garden center and every time that door opens, a bunch of cold air comes in here. I'm freezing my baguettes off. Steropod. This is a toothbrush protector. I reckon you can hang it on your tree. Oh, I like these flowers, these pink and white ones. These, these make me want to do a tree. Well, last year I did a tree in all pink and gold. I, you know, I'm thinking next year of doing like a pastel tree, not really pastel, but like these colors here, like lighter pink and fuchsia, mint green, something like that. I have a white artificial tree. We could decorate that. That'd be pretty. Jingle bells. You can get 18 jingle bells for $2.98. Some of them are kind of a rose gold color. I like them. Wow, that's a sparkly one right there. Look at all the glitter on that. It's beautiful. This one's made up to look like a balloon animal. <laughs> that doesn't go there. Oh, look at all the elephants. Oh my goodness. They're so cute. Yeah, we'll put this goes down here. Right there. It bugs me that these boxes are all <laughs> what in the world? I haven't seen any like this. Now, just my opinion. I think that's a little tacky. I'm not really fond of that with the rose in the middle. I haven't seen these before. I don't like it. I'm just being honest. I don't. 
I don't like those. Ooh, a moose. Look at the big old moose. Angel. These are more rustic looking, I guess. But to me, I mean, it's just my opinion. If you just do a tree all in like beige, it just looks kind of sad. I don't know. Here we have some black and, see if you do your tree all in black and white, like that modern farmhouse look. I don't know, it just needs some color to it. A unicorn. Oh, look at the bear, that's cool. Those are neat. Every time I see these, I just think it's a, it's a fancy number eight. That's all it looks like. A skiing squirrel, look at him. Oh my gosh. You know, Glenda the Good Witch has a condo up in the mountains, and he likes to put skiing stuff, because a lot of people go up there to go skiing. I'm, I'm gonna pick up a few little ornaments of skis, because we've got gnomes on skis, we've got squirrels. Here we have, I don't know, is that an owl? Or an abominable snowman? I don't know what that's supposed to be. It's like he's holding a tree in front of himself because he's trying to hide some. He might be a flasher. What is that? It's made out of metal. I don't know what it's supposed to be. Um, if you come over here, you can find some of the larger decorations. Look at these little reindeer. The only problem with these is they fall over very easily. We have a sled that says Noel. Oh, look at the little bird with a hat. We have a bunch of birds with hats. We have birds with different hats. We have ZZ Top. Look. It's awesome. Oh, wow. These are real metal bells. That's pretty. Here we have some, some more of the black and white decor with little jingle bells. You can get a metal angel garland. It's heavy. That's $4.98. I'm not sure where these are supposed to go. This is a snowflake garland. Oh, they do have ribbon too. Oh look, these are like decorations for one of the mini, the small Christmas trees. I love it. See, I'm kind of thinking about doing one of my trees next year. Kind of like, you know, with this kind of theme to it. I think that would be really pretty. Here's a ball. Oh, it's an ornament. It's a giant ornament with a sprig in it. I don't like it. It looks kind of plain. Little fabric trees. Uh, that's a beaded garland. See, it's just gray and white. I don't know. Not a big fan of that. I like for my Christmas ornaments to have some color to them. Now these are pretty colors. Look at this. Look at this. Now I do like these. That's a pretty color scheme. That would be fun to do. I like the blue ones. Those are pretty. Yeah, over here we have some of the ribbon. Ooh, look at that blue. Isn't that pretty? Oh, it shows you how to make um, a special decoration for your present. That's a lot of ribbon. That's only $6. This is a tree skirt. I thought it was like a jacket. It's, like a, it's a tree skirt. This one's interesting. It looks like the upholstery on my grandma's couch. I don't know how I feel about that as a tree skirt. This one's pretty though. I like it. It's woven like a sweater, but it has a, it has a gold metallic in it and a faux fur trim. And it has this uh, nylon lining underneath it. That's pretty. I do like that one. Over here, we have some nutcrackers that look like lumberjacks. Here we have more gnomes. Then you have you have fancy ornament hooks. No, I just use the regular. I don't care. Nobody's looking at the hooks. Here's some more garland. Oh, this garland has little tiny gnomes on it. <laughs> Neat. Now we're into feminine hygiene. That's not very jolly. Let's come over here. Wow, what have we got? 
Oh, look at the little tree. It has a unicorn head on top of it. <laughs> okay, and over here we have the decorations for many little bitty trees. So these are going to be tiny decorations. Look at the little sleds. Oh my gosh, they even have a mini tree collar for your mini tree. The mini trees have really taken off. Like, I mean, just a few years ago, you couldn't get all this stuff. Here is a navy blue mini tree. Now the tree itself is $9.98. They're almost out. Look, they have one green one left. They have one with a unicorn on, head on it. And that's it. Here we have these kind of decorations. The red and silver are pretty. I like that. Yeah, so this is all for, these are just for mini trees. I mean, you could put it on a big tree as well. And then they have big balls. You could get some big balls. Look at these. Here's a furry ball. Look at this hairy ball. I just want to hit somebody with it. <laughs> it's, um, that's $3.98, $4 for that hairy ball. It's got a disease, like it's got red dots all over it. I'm not a fan of the hairy ball. I don't like it. Ooh, this blue one is pretty. Look at this blue ball. It's not often you find a blue ball you like, but I like that one. That's delightful. Um, okay. Now we get into shatterproof. You can get shatterproof ornaments in different mixes down here. We have, ooh, these, one, these are pretty. I like these. So you can get all kinds of mixes of ornaments. Very nice. Um, these, I think those, these ornaments over here are glass. I do not want glass ornaments. Not with cats. Oh, and then they have the little Christmas village uh, pieces, like this. A little barn. Tractor rides today. Oh, it's got a little horse. A little horse is looking out. Here we have a wood pile, a wood pile scene. A baby wood pile with a squirrel on it. A dog, a dog letter to Santa. <laughs> a fire hydrant with it. It even has urine. Look, it has real urine. Well, it's not real, but you can see a dog peeing on the fire hydrant. A snowman with a lantern is a terrible idea. Don't you think that's a bad idea? I don't think you should be holding that. Santa carries gifts. I hope so. Here's a nativity scene. That's cute. Toys for Tots, Marine, and Santa. A swing. It looks like they're about to have a terrible accident. I don't really think that's going to go well. Look at them. <laughs> Look at these people. What are they up to? <laughs> oh, God. Okay. A girl walking dogs. She's not walking them. They're sitting there. You can even get a popcorn stand with styrofoam in it. Oh, I do like the Cardinals. They're animated. What do they do? They move. Okay. Santa in a convertible and it lights up. <laughs> That's pretty cool. A two-piece camping set. You can get a hot cocoa stand. Uh-oh, they got stuck in the snow. There's a, a floor polisher. Happy holidays to the floor polisher. An ice pond accessory, it's just a mirror. Here is a faux LED projector. It's massive. Get those kids away from the gears. Ooh, look at the carousel. It doesn't work. It's $40, wow. A 12-inch retro red truck. 
a moving water lantern. Oh look, it blows little glitter bits up. It's kind of janky looking. That looks weird. A six inch animated storytelling Santa. That's cr listen, that's creepy. They sound spooky. A nightmare before Christmas. Hey, you could even get a Walmart. What a coincidence. Hunt <laughs> greenhouse. A meal. Country store. Wow. I'm gonna get run over by the polisher. Okay. Oh, seeds. Look, you can get seeds. Over here we have some Carolina Panther stuff and Carolina. You can even get a Panthers gnome. Haha. <laughs> Cute. Let's come out here. Look at the squeezy. Oh, look at the giant squeezy. Oh my goodness. Look at this one. It's the Grinch. Wow. A big Grinch. He about ran me over. See, it's the joy shop. I about got killed by a polisher. We have pillows. Jingle all the way. Tis the season. Woo! Um, wow, look at the stars. Look at the tree toppers. Oh, so pretty. Oh, I like this one. This one's pretty. I have this one. I used it with my rustic Christmas tree last year. I, had, I do two trees every year. One of them last year kind of had this rustic theme to it. And the other one was pink and gold and fabulous. That's pretty. Ooh, I like this one too. Um, let's see. I definitely do not need any wrapping paper. I have so much wrapping paper, it's crazy. I'm not buying any more. I have way too much. Oh, here we have some more ribbon. Cute ribbon. Um, more wrapping paper. These are huge rolls. Now these I would probably, I probably do need some of these. I, I always run out of these. Little two from tags. Oh yes. Look at the size of that ceiling fan. Woo doggy. That's a big old fan. Um, so here we have gift bags. <laughs> It's a North Pole food truck. How do you keep that thing going in the North Pole? Wow, they have big fabric gift bags. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, this one's cute, the little wagon with a tree on it. I like that. All the different sizes of gift bags. Here's like a little wine bag. That's very pretty. Yep, and we, okay, these are more gift bags. Gift wrap, so you got tissue paper. You can get some with glitter on it. Gift bags. I bought one of these, but I couldn't get it to stay on my door. It wouldn't, it kept falling off. I'm trying to dodge people. <laughs> they didn't change their sign out, it's still home pest control. <laughs> you keep the pests out with gift bags. That's some technique I'm not familiar with. Down here we have lawn and garden stuff. You can get, these are just plain wreaths that are not lit so you can decorate them yourself. Ooh, look at this tree. I've already bought a new tree though. But we have, look at these trees. Wow, look at how big that one is. Wow, how tall is that thing? 12, this is a 12 foot tree. Wow. It says it's pre-lit, but I'm not a fan of these lights. Look at them. Look how that, that looks so tacky. I don't like it. I mean, it's only $279 for a 12 foot tree, but 
The way they have these lights, the wires and stuff, I don't like that. But they have, you know, different, different types. This is an LED tree for only two, $2.59. That's actually not bad. Oh, look at all the lights on this tree. Wow. It's like a little snowman tree. <laughs> You could get a black tree. I wanted one of these for Halloween. I mean, I don't know about Christmas, but for Halloween, I thought about doing a Halloween tree. I could get this pre-lit Madison pine for only $39. See, I could do a Halloween tree every year. This one has app-controlled lights. This one's $299. It's not too bad. <laughs> They've covered this one with little llama alpacas look at that this one too they had a lot of these ornaments and they do have the volkswagen bus type ornament i already have some of those and here you can get little trees i love the tinsel rainbow tree look at that again it says it's pre-lit i don't like the way the wires look on it it's only 30 dollars though oh look at the pretty wreaths i like this one that's beautiful. And big uh, sign things you can hang up. Wow. Oh, that one's pretty too. I like, oh, it's wood though. Have one with a, I guess it's a reindeer or a deer on it. Whatever you want to call it. And more ribbon. Look at all the ribbon. Wow. Big old ribbon. You can get a whole tower of ribbon. And a pink bow. That goes up there. And a red bow. Goodness, the ribbon just keeps going. And we have some mesh too, but it's that wider mesh. I don't use that. Although we do have a project, we have a project coming up. When I do my peacock tree, I'm going to use some really wide mesh on it. And it's a technique I've never done before, so I'm looking forward to trying it. Look at this Santa hat. Ooh, that's a cool Santa hat. Somebody's coughing up a lung over there, so I'm going this way. I don't want whatever she's got. <laughs> Look at that wreath. See, I, it's fine, but it, I just feel like it needs some color to it. It's so plain. I did buy one of these though, the Merry Christmas wreath. I bought one except mine has red in it instead of green. Um, we have these cool white spiral trees. These are our ex external exterior illumination thingies and I just got some receptacles put on the front of my house so I can finally plug stuff up in front of my house so I'm going to be doing some ex exterior illumination this year <laughs> you can get a car buddy <laughs> he's cute I want one of those for my car that's cute you could get a Santa Claus oh they have a, a buddy the elf that is so cute. I want one of those for my car. I don't know who's coughing over there, but I think Typhoid Mary needs to go home. What is this? What is this? Oh, it's a wreath hanger stand. Oh, that's interesting. I hope it's adjustable. Yeah, it is. There's a little, little thing here that you turn. I've never seen that. I thought it was like a fancy toilet paper holder of some sort. I was wondering what it was doing with the Christmas stuff. Wreath hangers. These are cute. Yeah. Oh, this one's adjustable. I've been looking for one like this. So you can hang it further down. Because I want one for my door but I want one that I can make longer, you know, that hangs down a little further. Neato. I'm gonna be doing some shopping over here. You can also get several different kinds of garland, like this nine foot non-lit Bethany garland. 
a Greensboro wreath. What makes it a Greensboro wreath? Is there a lot of construction for no reason? Do people drive on your bumper for no reason? How is this a Greensboro wreath? What's well, green? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why it's called that. I'm sure there's a reason. You could get a mixed natural garland. It's pretty, it's got pine cones on it. A natural wreath, it's a natural plastic. Totally natural. A flocked wreath. I don't like the stuff with the snow because it gets all over everything. So I don't really like that. Here's a Liberty Garland. That doesn't have the pine cones on it. Or you can get the pre-lit. Oh, that's pretty. Pre-lit pine garland for $12.98. Oh me, so many things to look at. Little LED candles. Those are fun. See, I have a lot of battery-powered lights outside because up until now, I didn't have any outlets out there, so I couldn't plug up anything. But now I can, so I'm very excited. And we have our lights. I like the net lights, those are pretty. See, I could do that this year. I could put up net lights on my, on my shrubs out front. If I wanted to, I could do that. But I'm gonna show you what I did do. I got one of the six foot LED twinkle willow trees. I got a six foot one, a five foot one, and a four foot one. Look how pretty they are. So I'm putting these outside this year. I did not get a seven foot. I decided to just do six, five, and four. I'll just leave it at that. Look at the little metal decor mailbox. It's so cool. Yeah, so over here they have some of their trees, like if you're looking for a tree to buy. This is fresh cut. If you've got your own, like a real tree, you can put it in one of these uh, tree stands like that. Oh, I like the Christmas lamp post. See, I could, I could get something like that and put it up because now I have somewhere to plug it up. Wow, look at the big Santa. We have some stacked snowmen. Nice. Huh, you could get a little, these are squeezies. My, my younger son used to call them squeezies, the inflatables. You could get a darling dachshund for only $14.98. Little weenie dog. I like Jack Skellington. This is $28.88 and he's 5.5 feet tall. I really like the car buddies. <laughs> I want a car buddy. I want to get Buddy the car buddy. I want that one. <laughs> Seriously, I might get one for my car. I think that'd be fun. I mean, I'm usually by myself anyway, so. Okay. Um. What is this? Oh, look at these cute little things. They have a lot of stuff still in boxes they haven't put out yet. That's okay. We'll come back out of here. Oop, I'm gonna hit the door. So yeah, look at these giant signs. God, they're huge. Mary's. I feel like I'd, I'd be yelling at somebody if I put that on the front of my house. This is a metal sign. What's over here? Tinsel garland. Tinsel. Hummingbird feeder. Well, I think we've run out of Christmas. We're into the bird feeders. <laughs> what is that? A suet log. It's a suet log. It's heavy. My bird seed has gone up. We do have some more Christmas stuff over here. Look at these big old gnomes. These are only $8.88. They're huge. <laughs> you could get a SpongeBob <laughs> square pants. This is must be just some overflow Christmas over here. Cozy socks. These are double layer. Cozy socks on a little cardboard display. More ornaments. These are just all silver. 
or all red. I love the fact that they have these little sets. So you could just mix and match and do your tree any way you want to. It's awesome. Yes. Hey, look, for your pet, you could get a stocking for your dog. These are only $4.97. You can get different types of sets. These Are these all dog toys? Why do people hate cat owners? Never find anything like this for cats. Well, sometimes you do. I've run out of Chris. How have I run out of Christmas? I ran out of Christmas. Well, shoot. These are cute little ornaments. Look at these. Little, they're styrofoam balls, but they're decorated up different ways. Christmas is on, oh God, IT apostrophe yes. Christmas, it's on, it is way. <sighs> Seriously. <laughs> what is wrong with people? Ooh, I like this picture. It's, it's a fox in the snow. That's six ninety eight. I like that. I find that every Walmart around here has different stuff. If you go to every one, you're gonna find different stuff. It's crazy. But yeah, it's a little messy over here. We already looked at all this. Look at that big owl, Gull. He looks pissed, look at him. How dare you, you monster. Look, he killed his friend, drunk again. Get back up there. Now you could be mad together. You look like me and any of my friends at a party. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm gonna take you over to the nail polish before we go because I want you to see, I want you to see why I haven't organized nail polish in this fancy Walmart in a little bit. Okay, okay, so here's the problem. Now this has been like this since January. See where there's no names on here? And some people say, well, Mary, why don't you just flip it up? Well, you flip it up and this doesn't help. <laughs> because it doesn't have, you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight spots, but you only have six tags. These tags don't really help. They don't help. Plus, I don't feel like doing this 400 times in a video. <laughs> no. So this is why we haven't done it because it's looked like this now since January. So for 10 months now, it has looked like this. Fortunately, there are other Walmarts not really close by but sort of close by that I can go to that we can do it but I always love doing it in here this is the one right next to the baking stuff <laughs> for whatever reason we have all the cake baking stuff and candy making stuff right beside the nail polish this is the best one but look at it it's an absolute disaster I thought they would have redone it by now but they haven't the customers have been kind enough to create a a lovely mural though they've look at this they've just painted everything and then you come over here to this sinful colors display look at what they've done to this poor lady you can't even see her face anymore look they've you can't even read and you can see, you see how the, the plastic looks frosted that's because an employee tried to use nail polish remover to take this off but the problem is it makes the plastic it damages the plastic and leaves it looking bad so you can't read it. This is why we can't have nice things because you see what people do. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed walking around and seeing all the cool Christmas stuff. And I, I always love doing that. So I hope you enjoyed seeing, seeing some of this stuff. Every Walmart's different though. This one seems to have cooler stuff than a lot of the Walmarts around here for some reason. But I hope you enjoyed seeing it. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. The front of the store is always a lot of fun too. Look at that giant tree, wow. Over here we have some pretty little ornaments that are just in the front of the store for some reason, but they're really cute. Look, it's like a little gift and lights oh look it's a little a little you could get a little hat and mittens those are cute 
I love the big Jack Skellington. Look at him. He's $29. Or you can get a great big Grinch for $29. These are $24.98. You could get a giant unicorn. You can get candy canes too. Or you could get oil. Look at all that oil. $7.82 for, for oil. And of course, the Thanksgiving's coming, so you start seeing like, you know, stuff for, you know, making stuff, cream of chicken, dressing. This is the one, this is the one my mom always used, the Pepperidge Farm. Yeah. Peanut oil for your deep fried turkey. Oven bags. Lorgias. Aluminum foil, foil pans, easy foil, roaster pans, Welch's sparkling strawberry daiquiri or cider, sangria. Yeah. Oh my lord, and this is the pickup where if you do an online purchase, you come to the pickup and I think they give you a code or something that you put in and you pick up your package it's like a vending machine, basically. Well, it's closed. Oh, it's actually closed at the moment, but normally you can walk up, put you in a code, and it will, your package is in there, and it will give it to you. Yeah, so the holidays are here.